Now, let's explore sampling methods for large language models. LLMs generate text through sampling. They produce a set of probabilities across the vocabulary and pick a token to follow the input sequence. You might think choosing the token with the highest probability is best. This approach is called greedy decoding. Another option is beam search, which generates multiple candidate sequences to maximize the probability of a sequence of tokens. However, neither method results in natural text. Text generated via beam search often has repetitions and lacks meaning. Researchers compared beam search to human generated text, finding significant differences. Human text appears more interesting and relevant. So we need alternative sampling methods. One option is called sampling with temperature. Adjusting temperature affects token probabilities with higher values resulting in more diverse outputs. Lower temperature makes less probable tokens even less likely. As temperature approaches zero, this method becomes like greedy decoding. High temperature values might generate less useful text and we will experiment with temperature in our next video. Another technique is top P sampling proposed by researchers studying beam search and human text. This method cuts off probabilities at a certain threshold, only considering tokens with higher probabilities. It excludes low probability tokens and samples from those with higher chances. Depending on the input, distribution may be flat or peaked, affecting token choice. Top P sampling is popular and, and results in high quality generated text. And again, that's something that we'll experiment in the next uh, video. Thank you.